as Senna. Yeah. So. Minutes. We'll have to pay attention to Freedom that to go over and just get the crowd, but they're going to go for is. a dive instead. <laughs> Let's take a look at that. Mm -hmm. Jonas Strong, thank you. He's uh, casually going to lose his entire health bar due to the Azir. That hard engage that they kind of, they, you know, they don't have too much hard engage, actually. They, they moved out of that once they picked up Jason Corky. Yeah. And moved into a more, you know, pokey style kind of mid to late game composition and the thing is is that it's not worth losing your life over a uh, the set the rift herald here because Ooh. there's no turret plates oh that's a nice amount that of is damage. yeah that that's very nice nidalee yeah. they have a three and a half thousand gold lead and okay uh. doron leashing the scuttle crab for a summit he's world ender here. yeah he's trying to get that movement speed he will dodge the senna seems a little bit too difficult for me well. And okay. Okay, 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 okay. Might have some action here. He got the knock up. There's the poke. And we got a kill, <laughs> ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Just the one, though. Just the one. <laughs> Might have a little bit more. Although, no. Trendle is pretty good at disengaging. They do get the flash, though, out of Gorilla. It's so, it's so impossible. There's a fight down For Sandbox to actually win this fight. And there goes Dub. Doran is going to die here. Yeah, he is going to die, but DRX should be able. It's going to come down to the spike, and there it goes to Nidalee, and now Trundle's probably dead. they got to focus on him. Azir, Toby trying his best. Dept is going to finish it off as Toby Nidal. is just going to survive here. Karia at the last second able to dump that Zillion ult on him. Changes Valkyrie. Toby comes in here. Okay, Sandbox, they're going to flip this. And honestly, they're about to get aced if they really handshake this. I don't know. Okay, they're going to land that Maokai ultimate into the back. The Senna ult is good, too, as Zillion just going to keep Pyoshik alive and say, OK, you tried to focus one guy. You're going to regret it. They didn't quite have the damage with Dove. The it's like, uh, remember Halloween there. Town when the guy got cursed? Was his name Zeke? I don't remember his name. But I you know what I'm know talking, what talking about, right? About, yeah, yeah, yeah. Finally. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> One reference. I got it. Had to reference a boomer show. Here yeah. we go. <laughs> okay. They're actually really tanky. Nice engage here for Root, trying to burst into the back line, but notice Keria holding on to that ultimate. He says, I'm not going to be baited into using it. And Toby in the front line, just able to cut them down. He's not really making a big move towards it yet. They actually want to go for the fight instead. As the Root is going to come down onto Doran, and he gives Root a way out, but it does not matter. Nice flashes out of the way there from Gorilla, just to make sure he doesn't die, but that's about all you're going to get, as Shovey was really trying to style there. Oh! And Root should die. Yeah. Nice catch from the side of Doran. Yeah. Makes it look really Heal easy. The Dragon Soul coming in, I think that this is probably just the end. Yeah. Oh, Zillion ultimate. And you can tell Doran not actually trusting Karia. Wasting Zillion ult. Oh, okay. That was a big so, one. So, yeah, that's going to let them fend this off a little bit. Dove and Summit, both teleport available. Mountain Soul is really obnoxious. And oh, I don't know what Gorilla's doing, okay. but that was very surprising. Trying to bait know. them, I guess, into it, but... DRX are very comfortable in this kind yeah. of situation. I mean, you can just zone them forever, yeah. poke them away. All right, I, is this what a front door is, or? <laughs> <laughs> I can't. <laughs> yeah, look at Kerry, he's just gonna run away, flash away, he's like, I gotta save my KDA. And that's the end of that one. Do anything. And so, just one of the unfortunate problems. Is they scale pretty good. And with the way that Quite they're being an Olaf on the enemy team. So he definitely pulled it a little bit as oh. Olaf is coming in here, but he's spotted, I believe. Yeah, well, this is still a little scary, Yatsi. Maybe not. As here we go, getting to work on Adoran, who's going to go the opposite way. He is going to flash, but he kind of failed over the wall. Gets close to Pyoshik here, who doesn't quite have the damage. He's still going to go crafted yeah, compositions. Yeah. Which is why there was also that talk about, you know, well, might have to hold that thought as, oh, it's just gonna go over the wall. There was also that talk about, um, 
having like the first two drinks visible. As here we go, getting into the action and down How it comes. How many years? Cosmic Radiance as a big knockoff comes in, but where is the follow-up from DRX? It's not really there. As that's a big knockoff onto the Aatrox, who's going to try to flash just to buy some time. And follow up there on a Pyoshik. Not really going to find the damage, though, as he was burning a bit. Dove not quite able to follow him down here. As Chovy with Flash is going to force the stopwatch, and the Whoa! wild card is going to get him, actually. But did he bait his team into a bad position here? Yeah. Dev is going to get clapped down, and Chovy is as well. And so many casualties now against DRX's Sandbox. They switched it back because they weren't doing it, actually. Yeah. No Flash here on Chovy. Is going to be able to get the red smite down. Do they have the burst? The flash out and the shield. Feeling oh. pretty inspired. Things are pretty interesting here. Now Gorilla, he gets tapped by the Cosmic Radiance. Aphilios uh, letting them know okay. yeah, how many years. Yeah. Way too many. There's the double kill. And by the way, it is uh, Karma TK. So you're, you're not going to be killing him here. As under the turret, he's able to threaten the yellow card. As interesting. And Kyoshik. Oh, oh line him up. man. Line him up. That's a two-man knockup only, which is a little bit surprising. No flash now on the summit, but they don't quite have the damage on the left to take him out. They have no damage in their team composition. You know, you were talking about... Well, let's listen to this. He said omo ah uh, f word almost and then seriously. So <laughs> he's not feeling pretty good. Is, yeah. Anymore. Uh Toby went in there. As I suppose he did, delayed the karma. He's going to actually walk away, but now he's got Olaf on top of him with karma shields and and Toby now is split pushing the side lane. He's probably going to be able to get this turret at least. Ah. Uh, okay. Um, that was his stopwatch, actually. He's trying to get out of here and, uh, well, say hello to Olaf. And see you later. Lista is going to heavily try to force this as now they're going to turn on the summit here. Might be able to get him, but no, it's Thomas Kench able to get in and say hello to Karma. Karia in the front line. They have the redemption, but that amount of healing is not going to be the same. They give away the Ocean Drake, not able to take away the Baron as their turn does not work. And now we got the turn actually from Sandbox. There's a nice knock up here from Doran. Might be able to save his team, but it looks like he's going to die instead. Still trying to force this one. Is Dragon X still looking for the fight? Still staying around? That might be their demise, although Death is getting some value in the back line. It's not as much as Root, who is just able, able to take out the inhibitor. As, okay, we are going to have a flank coming in from Doran as Karia eating a lot of that damage, and Gorilla is so tanky after all of that. And yeah, well, Felios is just going to lock you down. Meanwhile, in the front line, they didn't even need a Felios, and they're still winning the fight. And now he's here. Yeah, Josie is going to go down, and that should be the end of the game, guys. Not much else to say about this one. Very one-sided from Sandbox, it turns out, this time around. Yeah. And that is going to be all that she wrote here in game number two. Super Stomp by Sandbox. And, well, it looks like Dove is going to manage to... Wait, wait, don't kill the Nexus! Oh! Oh! Okay, GG. Well, one to one. Some yeah. really good one ultimates. Also, he right-clicked his teammates when they had items. That's cool. Whoa. Yeah, pretty fun. <laughs> Very well. So even if you get the Slicing Maelstrom, what kind of a dream trundle subjugate will deal that much less? So we find their hardest to crash in the bottom wave. Very big trade. Yeah, and Toby just gonna flash, but they're going for it anyway. Yeah, as to carry out with the bomby cinder right now. As Chovy might just die again here. 
Okay, bit of a trade-up on the top side. That's a lot of Maelstrom coming in. Summit doesn't have the damage, though. And with no flash, Jovi in a little bit of trouble, but he is able to dash away. Notice he was saving it there. Yeah, six gonna more pop. to go. Six waves. So about two minutes. Goshek getting caught oh by the boy. pillar, being told to go to sleep, and he's Holy dead. Shakes this happening. You can see on Fleek making his way up. Well, they're going to try to land the stun and then go for the burst, but you see the Kingslayer coming in. And now he got Trundle around as another spear is going to miss. And from downtown, forcing the flash here is Dove, who is going. He's up an entire Amp Tome as well as the Sork Pen Boots. Trying to burst down Dove. That would be a really nice pick. The Culling does about 90% of his damage. And uh, okay, that's not even going to hit either. Everybody desperate to get on in there. And finally, Dorn. Spear. There we go. Bingo Summit, but immediately he has to flash away. And stealing Senna's ultimate is not going to help you there. As he Run on over to the Infernal Dragon. If DRX do end up getting it, all things should be pretty oh. well. Deathy flashes out of the way into the enemy team. Double culling coming out here, but now you don't have a Senna and a lot of stuff. MS, but 15 seconds, and really all Sandbox have to do oh boy. <laughs> is burst down this track. And Toby is just frontlining now. Nice sidestep, but that's two flashes now from both Pioshik and Toby, not to mention the cleanse. But DRX could use those cooldowns to their advantage. We don't have Arrow coming out here anymore from the Oh, Ash. man. Yeah, there's Summit into the back line. Trying to disperse down depth, and he will do that. He has a Zonia's finished already. Doran not nearly able to do as much, although he does survive for quite a while towards the end there. We still got Pioshik near half health. He's keeping the team alive. Oh. He's going to actually hit the Dragon there. And, oh. Oh, nice grab on a dump that was huge from Keria, and now that's going to be two and that they do. And. No smite. Yeah. I, I, I'm not no really smite sure. smite available. That was a little bit early, but it did not matter as it's the Baron in the. The RX have almost managed to penetrate this turret. Yeah, you can see the pig trying to come down Whoa. here. Toby takes a huge burst in the back line. Oh, and Doran? Doran is getting to work there. Yeah, he's going to be able to get that turret. Yeah. Get this inhibitor. The Lich Bane. I suppose going to help out a little bit there. And, well, the poke still coming in, but there's no arrow, and it looks like the pillar is down as well. For the Vanilla ice cream is really cool. Okay. Okay. I like that. I All like right. the Baron going down, too. All right. There I you told go. you. Vanilla ice cream engaged from Doran. But it's not playing at all as he gets in there and Caria is able to get in the back line and immediately they are just white off the floor. <laughs> I think I can hear the ice cream truck in the background. As they're just gonna stop the back here of Von Fleek, and that should be the end of the game. As yeah, you're gonna try to Nimbus Cloak away, but it is a Nidalee. You are not getting away from him. That's gonna be another kill. Going to the side of Piosik, and that will be GG in 33 and a half minutes. Down will go the Nexus. DRX took them a bit longer than we expected, but they still rage when he heard about the yeah. vanilla ice cream. I didn't want to have to pull out that card this series, but. You wanted to see him.